Hey guys, it's Shauna, and I am back with another haul. I know, epic failure on the spending freeze, but I caved on a few things last week, way too many things, and just going to share them with you. I should have some more projects coming up, because Saturday I have a crop, so I'm definitely going to have some time to work on things. And I guess that's really it for my rambling. Um... Filming like this because every time I focus downward I have a shadow. So I thought I'd try like this. And it's a little busy of a background. But it just happens to be where I normally film. So actually that's a new shelf I found at Target today too. If you guys are looking for something similar. And also at Target I found a new paper pad called Spring from American Crafts. So it has some nice little designs on it. I like the colors a lot. It's going to be good for cards, I think. It's really like smaller, subtle patterns. <coughs> Excuse me. So the world's smallest two-piece order. Got a bunch of their new wood veneers. Oh. Ugh, why can't I think of the name of this right now? Viewfinder thing. Camera. Oops, I'm off camera. Kind of hard to see these in the background, sorry about that. This camera. A couple cute little coffee cups. This one's like a cutout one. And then a solid one. And a light bulb. And last, a cloud. I love clouds. And then I ordered one tiny little flare. It says, Love This Life. Sorry for the glare. My whole order was like not even $7 and they sent it in a small flat rate box. And that was with shipping included. So I don't know how they made anything off of that order. Okay. These are from Etsy. They're like a little felt dot, I guess you'd say. And they're puffy so they have a little border around them. I thought they'd be bigger but I think they're going to be really cute if I use them like I do my enamel dots. So pick those up. I can't remember the name of the Etsy shop, so if you really want to know, just send me a message and I'll post it for you. Uh, I picked up a couple Mama Elephant stamp sets. This one's called Wonderlust. It's an older set I've been wanting. Let me zoom in a little. I just really like that. We came, we saw, we conquered. And then I picked up a somewhat newer set called Origami. I thought this was really cute. I need to pick up the dies. I love the little crane. So cute. I saw someone, like, did something different with the stamp set and somehow did a Yoda out of it and I had to get it. Like, from Star Wars. Because I'm a Star Wars geek. And, okay. This is my big splurge from Your Scrapbook Supply. They had all the new, I think it's new, um, fairly new <laughs> Webster's Pages stuff in, and I adore this stuff. So I went a little crazy. This is called Frames Vellum, and it's from the Your, or Our Travels line. So it's like Polaroids and some little tags in vellum. And they're like all patterned and things. So cute. Then, this one's called Sky Vellum, and this is so gorgeous. This is what kind of drew me in. One piece of vellum, and I turned into $80 later. And, but how gorgeous is this? I love it! I'm such a cloud freak when it comes to scrapbook items. So I got two of those. It's going to look pretty in Project Life and on layouts. And, what should I share next? This is from Our Travels as well. And this is designed by Adrian Lumen. This is the little stickers. And I got the 6x6 pad for our travels. I'll show you the 12x12 papers in a minute, but I just wanted to share that real quick. And this is from Sweet Routine. This was an Adrian Lumen dis um designed line too and these are cute little clock charms. I 
don't know why I needed these, but they're adorable. And I also picked up the Alice and Craft Hello World ones. I didn't need any of like the baby theme paper, but I thought these charms were really cute. They're on the bottom there, but you can see better if you look at the picture of them. So the actual size is a lot smaller than those pictures, but really cute bows and arrows. And then, this is from Growing Up Girl. These adorable little, like, I don't know whether to call them minty or aqua colored. I guess in between. Little heart keys. They're so cute. And then, from Hello World, I got these clips. They're birds and speech bubbles. So, really cute. And, come on, I hope you can see these. There's elephants and onesies in here. I don't need the onesies, but I could not pass up those cute little elephants. And then these are from our travels, and it comes with arrows and cameras. And next, I picked up this huge chipboard album. It's, let's see, six by nine. And I'm going to open up and show you guys what's inside. Sorry, that's really loud. So if you want to fast forward, if you don't want to see this album. That's cool. It, of course, comes with the binder rings. There's two of them. And so it's from the Our Travels line. And it kind of just like cardstock. Little die cut heart. Looks like it comes with two of those pages. So you can actually potentially make two albums, I suppose. And then you can put them right on the chipboard. So there's a bunch of chipboards here with the tabs. Two, three, four, five, six total. And then it gives you more papers. Oops. Sorry, let me get that cute little deer. And you could always change the papers or add more. Comes with two of each. This is the back of that one. It says, and so the journey begins. I'm trying, well, not trying, I'm thinking of using this for my road trip at the end of summer. We're going to be driving from Pennsylvania to Washington State. So that's going to be a long haul <laughs> with two kids and two dogs. This one, oh, these cute little deer. Hmm. Oh, that's cute with the little Polaroids. This is so incredible. And then more clouds that say picture perfect. And a little like constellation map. And that is it for that album. So that's going to be really cute. I don't do a lot of minis much, but that one just caught my eye. Let me put it back before I make a mess here. One second. Next, I am going to share the 12x12 12 Sweet Routine and Our Travels Collections. So, it comes like this in a package like normal collection kit. Pull everything out. Comes with this packet here journaling cards and the like. Let's see. I love the way you smile at me. Oh, they're double-sided too. I'm super smart, just in case it wasn't already clearly visible. That's really cute. Memory, or manicures today. That's cute, the books. Journaling, a 
little banners, playing and posing with a camera. Favorite. You and me. So cute. Someday you will change the world. I just like the colors of this line. It's really pretty. And this is like a little file folder that's adorable. All these are actually. And this one's this way. So cute. I'm so glad I splurged on these. And then these are just bigger cards. Oh, that's cute. And then one big file folder. So that's what came in that little packet. Let's see. And then the papers. This is called Chic Home. Really pretty colors. And that's the back. And it comes with this around the house and it's journaling or Project Life cards, whatever you want to do with them. Lots of cute ones there. I love this polka dot on the back. And then this one, it says that playing and posing with a camera again. And down here it says selfie. It's like a ledger print. There's pretty butterflies on the back. I love this camera one. It almost reminds me of Maggie Holmes line for some reason. Polka dots. These are cute. Um, you can cut them out with a paper punch and use them like embellishments. The back. Some pretty blue and pink. Sorry, I quit saying the names of these. They're all from Sweet Routine. Some wood grain. And then there's that. I love the way you smile at me again. All rose. Polka dots. And some more cards. Some more posies. And then really care for that, but I guess it'll do. There's a lot of floral in here. This is just a really pretty line. There's the books again. Some green across the bottom and a ledger on top. And this pretty pattern goes the whole way around. Some larger polka dots. And the banners. And then this one has like a laundry going here. <laughs> like for real, there's the laundry. Oh, I guess the cat is sleeping in the laundry basket. And then that's the back. So that is that kit. So it comes with all those papers and the little cards. And I'm also going to share the Our Travels one real quick. I'm sorry for all the noise. Okay. So, starting with the cards. Let's find a beautiful place to get lost. Favorites. Today. Picture perfect. This was amazing. A little out and about one. Oops. An anchor and destination. I totally hope you didn't just hear my toilet flush in the background. My daughter's <laughs> the bathroom's right by my craft room, and my daughter just came out. So I apologize. It's just gross. You might not have even heard it, and I totally wasted my time talking about that, but just in case. So, some more folders. 
arrival. It'll be good when we finally get to Washington. Finally. And one more folder. Oh, look inside the clouds. Love this. It's so pretty. So, papers. Clouds. And then it has, and so the journey begins. Pretty floral. Oh, let's see. This is pretty. Look, I was all worried about shadows, and now I'm seeing them on from my hands instead. Sorry. That's cute with the airplanes. Oh, I love these little cards, like the two by two ones. Oops, anchors. Oh, this is pretty. Love it. Some bokeh. And some floral. And more cards. This line is great. So it's like a chalkboard with a border and it says amazing. Whoops. The journey of our lifetime. And then it has room for journaling and then like a little scene at the bottom. It's really cute. Some orange, which I love lately. Orange and green, not together, but I've already said that. So, anyway. so this one has a little porter. It says, when you open your heart to new experiences and allow your journey to be uncharted, you will see your life in a whole new light. Cute. I like that, too. Could use some of those journaling things. Got this. A camera up the top. And that's cool. They remind me of compasses, which I'm sure that's what it's supposed to be since it says this way. And then the little traveling deer, I suppose. <laughs> I don't know what the deer has to do with anything, but it's still adorable. This is pretty cool. Try it back up there so you can see the whole thing. I guess. I don't know if it's for charting stars, but it's cool. And then, this is like the vellum, but it's with on pattern paper instead, the clouds. It's beautiful. And this. And the last one has a little bit of bokeh at the top. And it says, so many places to see. And the back is kind of plain. So that is it, finally. I hope I haven't bored you too much. I just thought those lines were beautiful and I wanted to share them with you guys. And so that's it. Thanks for watching.